that's the thing. You're hoping to strike the first blow. Um, obviously, it's you know the, the Six Nations matters. Um, so first and foremost, we have to focus on that. But we know, you know, the world that World Cup group game is is a, of all importance. Um, and we'll be hoping to, you know, I suppose, strike that first psychological blow. That's uh, that'd be a good, good thing to say. Um, but look, it's it's you have to take the game on its own merit. It's 80 minutes. It's Wales against England. You know, irregardless of what competition it's in, it's uh, it's a huge game in itself. And for us, you know, to start gathering and building momentum towards the World Cup, it's a huge game for us. Yeah, I think it is a very open Six Nations. Uh, as you said, Scotland have improved hugely, as of Italy. Um, I think Ireland have had a wonderful autumn. You know, they're really, they're really strong as a team at the moment, and obviously very well coached. Um, you know, we've improved, I think, significantly in the autumn from where we where we were last year. Um, you know, in England as well, they were, you know, they're a team on the up. So it's, uh, you know, that open. The open nature of the tournament is going to make for some fantastic rugby, and, and certainly it's the team who grabs, you know, grabs the tournament by the scruff of the neck is going to win it. You know, you have to go out and attack, play positive rugby, and uh, you know, go go to go out to win it. Yeah, and it's it's great preparation for the World Cup. I think every player, you know, first and foremost wants to impress over January now and getting that Six Nations squad. But you know that uh, you know the Six Nations is a huge. Huge shop window for World Cup preparation, and you know one which you want to play very well in to get selected for the World Cup.